right, welcome to One Message in a Bottle Tarot. My name is Juan and I am your spiritual advisor. Hello and welcome back to all my beautiful messengers around the world in your respective places. I appreciate and love you so very much for every single thing that you do. Number one, being a subscriber, liking my videos, sharing my content, connecting with me in the comments. I really appreciate hearing from you. All the love, the tips, the donations, okay, everything that you do to help my channel to grow and to keep me buying cars, coffee, tea, and all that stuff. Like, thank you. Uh, Patreon members, hallelujah. Personal clients, amen. Thank you so much for your loyalty. If you're new here and you want to stay, you're more than welcome to join the gang. We love to have you here. So tap in if you like, or if you just want to show general support, give the kid a thumbs up. Uh, these are general readings for entertainment purposes, but I be knowing what the fuck I'm talking about. <laughs> okay. All right, so let's get into your April monthlies. Uh, it's, on, it's only uh, four gang in here. Okay, we doing Gemini, Taurus, Leo, Cancer, Cancer. You're up first because uh, you pulled up first um, on this. Yeah, I was like, um, you know, why put energy in the people that don't even show up? Okay, maybe that's what you're feeling or need to be feeling or considering. Cancer, why put uh, energy into people that don't even want to show up, that don't even want to uh, do the work? So all the rest of the Zodiac ain't here, okay? I don't know. It's, it's giving that one song. Um, now that I don't have a lot of friends, like it's more peaceful. It should be very peaceful around you. It should be very, like, I don't know, quiet, okay? Not so much noise. Um, Usher's in the background. You make me want to. You may be reminiscing, you may be thinking, all right? Leave it to somebody to be with somebody else. I don't know. Your situation is out of control, whatever it is, okay? Hurt feelings. Uh, but yes, I also feel that um, you keep revisiting something, okay? Starting, stopping, starting, stopping. Okay, it may be decisions or something. I don't know, but it's... Uh, you're still trying to get perspection or perspective on something. Yeah, I like that. You see, I had to turn down the noise so I could fucking hear. So I could think, all right? Um, you may be feeling that also, or maybe you need to do that. Turn the noise down in your li uh, hmm, life. I meant to say life. But, um... Yeah, also on social media, too. All right. Um, I'm here. It's like it's too many people in the room. It's too many people talking. Okay. Um, so that means you definitely need to eliminate some people. All right. Uh, and maybe you have done that. Some you're still on the fence about. Um, trying to make up your mind. But I feel like you've uh, went through a nice chunk. Okay. And it's a lot. At least it should be a lot quieter than it was. Okay. Um, let's do cancer, uh, what they want to say to you. All right. I want to pull three Zodiacs, uh, Aries. It is Aries season. Okay. So cancer and Aries wants to say, uh, you will make your parents proud. Okay. So if you're worried about how your parents, uh, see you or whatever, a lot of times, again, we're a lot harder on ourselves than others are, whatever the case, whatever it looks like. Uh, whichever parent you're thinking of in particular, as I'm saying this, they're proud of you. Uh, you're doing a good job. Okay. Like, all right. Taurus, your family will adopt a pet. So family is definitely a theme here for you. Um, cancer, you may get a new pet, be considering or need to for yourself or somebody else. Uh, pet therapy, I was just watching it on TV. Uh, so if you don't have a pet, okay, uh, maybe you should consider getting one. Like, a, you know, go go get a dog. Go get somebody at home is what I'm hearing. Uh, whatever the case that may, it says adopt, all right? Your family, I don't know if you have kids, whatever's going on, but, um, or maybe you get an additional pet or something uh, different here. And an Aquarius, all right? Treat yourself to some... I, lo I know, I just said, okay? Um, and pets aren't noisy, uh, unless it's a dog and or a cat fighting. Somebody's fighting like cats and dogs, or maybe you were fighting like cats and dogs here. All right? Um, so be careful in what kind of uh, pet you adopt. 
Um, but definitely, uh, I want to be down. Brandy is playing in the background. Okay. Um, yeah, I feel like you think and reminisce and thinking about uh, something, uh, somebody. All right. But also family here. Okay. Um, you're able to treat yourself better when you have alone time. All right. This is in regards to Aquarius. All right. So maybe you are separating or you've taken, you've put in, put or created some distance between you and you and an Aquarius. I feel like, uh, there's somebody you can't, um, either somebody can't communicate with you or you have a hard time communicating with somebody in particular. Okay. You know, pets are usually a comfort thing. Uh, it's kind of like a, a self safe soothe. At least that's what I think they're for here. So you may have a Taurus that makes you feel like that. Not that they're a pet or anything, but um, I feel like you want closeness. You desire, you know, most pets fuck with you regardless, if that makes sense. Okay. What is this uh, Aries trying to say with the parents? In the back of an Uber pool drunk. Yes, you may be thinking about the past, past mistakes, how you grew up or uh, how uh, just things your parents may be disappointed in, uh, your low moments or, you know, uh, things not so flattering, something like that. Uh, I feel like if it's... Uh, you know, 50 to 50 percent, equaling up to 100, it's like a 75 25. You know, it's not that big of a deal for the guy who doesn't who doesn't give a fuck about you. All right, so your parents may feel like you hang around a bunch of people that either uh, don't bring out the best in you or um. Or they don't give a fuck about you, okay? Or you may have an Aries that don't give a fuck about you. Maybe it's your drinking partner or something. I don't know. All right. What the hell is a, a, a Uber pool? Is that like when you're in a car with a bunch of people? I don't know. I feel like a, a not so flattering moment, something like that you may be worried about. Like, damn, if my mama saw this, like I would, like, I don't know, an embarrassment or something like that. But I feel like uh, you're good, all right? If you stop hanging around people where you're getting caught up in these um, compromising uh, situations, I don't know. Uh, again, you... you... <sighs> Cucumber from Veggie Tales. Yeah, these are, you might hang around some infantile people people that kind of um i don't know you're you're better than that all right you may feel like um you have some things uh or you are af afraid of ashamed of and all yeah or, or you may have a parent just saying like you need to kind of grow up you need to kind of clean it up you need to kind of like bring it together bring it on you know what i mean like um uh going from boys to men that song okay Taurus, what does this Taurus have to say to you? All right, yeah, so your parents may be telling you to clean up your act like you're proud, they're proud of you, maybe you're successful or whatever, but you may have a parent saying, uh, basically get it together, all right, especially those of you if you have alcohol problems or something like that or addictions, stop hanging around people that don't give a fuck about you, stop acting like a child, okay, yes, your parents are uh, proud of you, but they want you to grow the fuck up, okay, what else for cancer? And this pet. All right. An old navy dressing room. I don't know what you're doing in there, but okay. You may have a classic uh, kind of clean. Is all the navy clean cup? I mean, what are they? I don't know. Clothes and fashion are so boring nowadays. So I. Uh, what is this family pet? Oh, wait a minute. Let me find it. Why don't you stop bitching about it? All right. You might have a boss or somebody that's uh, getting on your nerves. Okay. Somebody has an issue with the way they dress or the way they look in clothes or, or whatever. Something. Um. 
like that. Maybe you're trying to find your style or something here. Uh, cancer. Um, I don't know. Somebody has a problem with the way they look in the mirror. And it's just like, I feel like your spirit guides are basically like, um, you know, either do something or shut the fuck up, period. Okay. And some of you don't know who you are without your friends. And I feel like your spirit guides, are, uh, for those of you that don't have a, a pet or a personal something, that's why you're being told to uh, get one and kind of face yourself and face your things and, and all of that. I don't know if you're going out for a new uh, wardrobe or, or something like that. All right. It's kind of always complaining about your family or whatever, friends or, or something. Okay. But it's just like, we'll uh, get rid of the old to bring in new energy. Okay. If you leak your uh, Photoshop nudes. Yeah, I said somebody got caught. Uh, you may have gotten caught or somebody you know in an uncompromising position. But um, this happened because of uh, some infantile friends or some people that you're uh, hanging around here. All right. Uh, you may have a friend. I don't know if it's a tourist or maybe you leaking the tourist nudes. I don't know. Somebody leaking somebody something or Telling if a uh, word, uh, word whispers about what you're doing could be getting, you know, on your personal time could, could be getting back to your people, your family, your friends. And it's just like, man, what are you doing here? You know, get it together. If you keep having friends betray your trust, then get fire everybody and get new friends here. Quit uh, talking about or bitching about how you get kept getting uh, keep getting caught lacking. What does this Aquarius have to say? Yeah, this Aquarius probably told you to fire everybody. Are you fired an Aquarius uh, here? What does this treat yourself? What does this Aquarius have to say to Cancer? If you keep posting thirst traps on the uh, gram. So, right. Some of you, um, somebody may have gotten hacked, okay? Or will get hacked or whatever. I don't know if you... Uh, you know, don't, hopefully you did and you ain't leaking your nudes for attention because just the thirst is real. I don't know. Um, <laughs> but somebody, I feel like, I don't know, you have a bunch of infantile friends that may get you in trouble to do stupid shit. And then you have like a strong core of, of family members and maybe like that one good friend that's like, you know, uh, what, what the fuck are you doing here? There's a, you have a few people trying to tell you the truth here. All right. And somebody's not careless, uh, not careful. Yeah, you're careless about uh, whatever it is that you're doing. I don't know if you uh, taking new pictures, posting your close friends, or whatever, whatever. But some some of this shit gets out. I don't know if you done sent the picture to your daddy or your granny. Some you doing something, moving something too fast, and go send something somewhere, and your people gonna be like, oh yeah, you know what I mean? Like a very, I'm, I don't know, some about some uh, pictures, some photos, or something here right and if a friend that leaked these that you already knew what it was with this person so you shouldn't really be surprised okay um the only thing this should tell you is that yeah you need to clean fucking house here while whispering tongue twisters out loud to yeah this is the only way yeah whispering people are talking i don't know you have people talking about you all right your exploits whatever it is that you're doing or somebody has proof or caught you lacking i don't know if you um uh, I don't know what you do. Okay. I just feel like somebody got uh, caught you lacking. Or, caught, or you caught somebody lacking. Somebody got some photographic evidence or some, something like that. All right. After your wife of 25 years uh, leaves you for one of her uh, honor students. All right. So I don't know. Maybe you got, uh, maybe somebody got uh, news of you or your person. I don't know. Here, there's an embarrassing uh, situation, but I feel like the situation is avoidable if um, you'd be realistic and be truthful about uh, the company that you're keeping here. All right. Some of you may be going through a separation or whatever, or some or somebody's married and they wife fucking somebody younger. Uh, I don't know. Or at school, if they go into school or, or something like that. 
somebody wife fucking somebody at school or whatever. Um, what time is it? Cause I hold up, fifteen. Okay. All right. What else does Cancer need to know for May twenty twenty three? So do with that what you will. And these, this is a new deck, guys. So. What is that? Two of Cups, all right. So, a partnership. No, Two of Swords, all right. Yeah. You're at an impasse, an indecision about something here. You're saying, like, uh, I don't know, something is like you're, uh, you don't see coming here, all right. Somebody may have uh, sent somebody's dick pic or something like that, a nude or something like that. Somebody's going to leak a nude. Hopefully you don't leak it. Somebody's going to leak a picture of somebody drunk and just like, you know, one of them pictures here, okay? Uh, somewhere you ain't supposed to be or something, something like that, all right? Somebody might have a more pictures of somebody white or some, something. This ain't for everybody. Anyway, what does uh, Cancer need to know for... This came out again, twice. Page of Wands here. Nine of Swords. Yeah, I feel like you get caught lacking because um, I feel like at a certain time you were offered an opportunity uh by spirit to kind of just do an upgrade kind of uh, get it together here you didn't do that so this just feels like another lesson that you're going to learn or are currently learning or whatever whenever this hits or if it hit, hit in the past this lesson was because you refused to um up do the necessary upgrade all right and get rid of these infantile um childish people uh, around you here and i feel like somebody plays too fucking much and you end up getting uh really 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 hurt and you'll feel really really betrayed and backstabbed by this all right and uh some dude threatened pictures or some uh, uh somebody threatened pictures of somebody's news i don't know if it's your girl if it's your masculine because this cucumbers out here and his, his wife's out here uh somebody fuck with somebody young and they get them exposed it's kind of giving like instagram groupie and uh you know the, the nigga sleep in the background who was the last one i saw yeah 21 savage and this was in the background like <laughs> teaser yeah okay somebody yeah unfortunately it's very, very embarrassing. Uh, public humiliation here, Ten of Swords, and it leads to a drastic uh, ending here. Probably not only with your partner, whoever it is, but uh, people around you who were involved in this. Again, I feel like they were friends, and it maybe it gets back to your family. Okay, but some there's a there's a childish energy around that is either. Uh, threatening to embarrass you or thinks it would be funny to embarrass you or leak something or or something okay um in april so watch out for that queen of wands somebody also uh yeah it may be a masculine out here that uh does revenge porn so divine feminine for cancer watch out for that all right here some of you feminists have a salacious uh, past or whatever, uh, and you have a partner out here. They don't. They don't care. They love you. They don't care. If people whispering. Well, they don't care what people say. Uh, you're that person here with this uh, ten of cups. All right. Some of you feminists have a past or whatever. Your part. Uh, I don't know. Your person doesn't care. Somebody also, I feel like, did a private investigator or investigator wants to know everything about uh, somebody, whether you're a masculine, but I feel he's strong, feminine, and once you found out what you found out, you didn't give fuck. You still. I don't want this person uh, anyway. If anything, uh, whoever was gossiping or slandering or trying to turn you away from your person, you ended relationships uh, with them because you see their whole thought process and all that. And it's just like, you know, if I'm really happy, why would you try to sabotage that with some um, bullshit? You know what I mean? Like you, you catch on to something. All right. I do feel like you get exposed or somebody else gets exposed trying to uh, expose somebody else. Does that make sense? Okay. All right. Let me wrap this up. Love for cancer, please. 
April. I keep wanting to say May, but it's April. Somebody know it may be April. That's two bam of many. Let me look this in here. Okay. I love the April. Cancer, please. It's two. Alright, like love control issues. Alright, it is safe for you to love again. I don't know, you might be a little gun shy after uh, you go through this, after you create your little, uh, your new beginning. Alright, but again, this time is about, uh, I wouldn't say being fluid, but, um, you know, you can't operate in the same way that got you where you are. You're going to have to move uh, different. Maybe you got caught up or uh, were vulnerable because you refused to let yourself uh be vulnerable. I don't know if that makes sense, but just think about it. Okay. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. So this is going to hurt. This is going to sting. All right. You may become very obsessive about, again, who you let in your inner circle with this whole situation, but you'll be all right. All right. Express your love and it looks like you have a soulmate coming in. Okay. I feel like if you have concerns, uh, it's okay for you to love this person, trust this person, all right? But you can't uh, control this person. Uh, if it's your soulmate, I mean, it's, they just are. So, you know, like controlling the narrative that really doesn't work uh, with soulmates. Final thoughts. Yeah. This ain't in uh, everybody's tax bracket here. All right. But watch out for a, uh, a servant or those of you that have people uh, in your home. Maybe they do laundry or whatever. Uh, somebody silly. Somebody, uh, somebody goofy or some of you can't trust your staff or you have some funny feeling about some staff or somebody who's working on something. Trust that and fire them. Okay. Moving on. All right. That's what I have for you, Cancer. Um. I usually don't deliver my readings like that, but I felt like it just had to be. I don't know. Um, you're pondering a lot of things, but hopefully that uh, cleared some debris for you. Do me a favor. Like this video. Leave your comments. All right. Let me know what you think or what this could be. Also, you can book a personal reading. The information is below. Tip me, the bartender, cash app, or PayPal. Uh, like, share, subscribe. I love you with the highest love. One.